Uh, my name is Natasha Krins and I come from the University of Liège where I got my PhD in chemistry and for uh, the moment I am a postdoc in Paris but I am also an assistant in Liège too so I do I do both and next year in January I will like I will go now it's it's certain I will go to the National Laboratory of Berkeley and uh, to to work on of their energy to work on improving their energy storage and that's my goal there. I choose the United States because it is for me the the the, the opportunity to, to create many collaborations with many new people and also to open my mind about culture but also about chemists about the way they work and all of that stuff. It will be I'm very exciting in going so I will advise them to not to to be afraid of applying for the Fulbright because it's one stuff. I have a friend who wanted to who wanted to apply and who did do not want because he was afraid. And I think you you have to not be afraid and to go for. And it's 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 quite administrative, full, but it's it's okay. It's so it's a very nice um, goal. So. <laughs> I chose Berkeley because um, in this lab they, they focus on uh, the, the, the lithium battery activity in itself and not really on the synthesis of the materials and that's what was different from Chicago because I have to choose between Chicago and Berkeley and that's why I will go to Berkeley and also because San Francisco is so cool. <laughs> go to the US and discover culture, discover people and have fun and also enjoy your life as a researcher and also as a human. Il faut aller aux états unis justement pour pouvoir découvrir, découvrir une nouvelle culture, découvrir de, de nouveaux chercheurs, découvrir une, une nouvelle façon de voir les choses. Et je pense que c'est ça qui fera avancer les, la recherche, c'est d'ouvrir son esprit aux autres.